My name is Alice Montero and I'm a fine arts major at Bristol Community College. I am apprenticing at Dark Star Tattoo and Body Piercing in Westport, um, which is a public owned studio that does body art practitioning, which basically just means that it's a public tattoo shop. I'm a shop apprentice, which is a little bit different than a tattoo apprentice because you get mentored by everybody at the shop instead of just one specific tattoo artist. Instead of just observing tattoos all the time, I also get to see kind of the business side of it, taking deposits and setting up appointments, checking in people. And then on the tattoo side of it, it's a lot of drawing. It's a lot of observing tattoo artists as they work. Constantly drawing makes you a lot more confident, which is really important when you're permanently altering the way that somebody looks. There's just a lot of customer service skill that goes into it. So being able to like talk to people and it's kind of like an intimate thing, that's been really helpful. So I'm really fortunate because when you have an apprenticeship, you're guaranteed a job at the shop once you're done with it. So in that way, it's directly prepared me to work at Darkstar because I know everything there is to know about their decontamination processes, you know, their emergency processes, stuff like that, how to set up, how to break down, how we work at the shop together. But just in like the broad spectrum of the tattoo industry, I've learned so much about the culture of it. And it's only become like commonplace and even legal in really recent years. So I feel very fortunate to be like involved in that culture. I love the people that work there. I love them so much. They're my family, 100,000%. They're so open-minded. They're so concerned about me and my future and they really care about where I'm going with this. Some of the things that I learned at my internship that I wouldn't have learned in a classroom is just how to tattoo. That's something that I think is a really hands-on process, especially when it comes to contaminated instruments that we need to use again, like how to use an autoclave is something that I think I really benefited from actually being there and seeing people do it, as well as the culture of it. I think you really need to, you know, like immerse yourself into it to actually understand it. You should participate in an internship because it will give you real life skills and it will show you the real life day to day of what goes on in your career path. There's a lot of tiny little things that you would never think of. And if you're really lucky, you also get to involve yourself in a community and find people that you really care about.